Good morning. Welcome to the forecast discussion for Thursday, May 21st, 2020. Of course, I'm your meteorologist, Stephen DiMartino, and we are getting ready for the Memorial Day weekend. Now, Memorial Day weekend is going to be split into two stories. The first will be rainfall, very heavy at times, especially as we head on through Friday night into Saturday. And then the second half it's actually going to be pretty pleasant. Onshore flow, so not exactly going to be warm, but still overall not too bad uh, considering the cloud cover that we've been dealing with. Plenty of sunshine will be on the way. For today, sunshine is definitely going to be in place with high pressure basically sitting right over the region this morning. Now we're getting this weak northeasterly wind around 5 to 10 miles per hour. As the high pressure system shifts off more towards the Gulf of Maine will see a little bit stronger northeasterly wind around 5 to 15 miles per hour by this afternoon. But overall, tranquil weather conditions with temperatures ranging from the upper 30s to mid 40s over the interior and mid to upper 40s along the coast. A few lower 50s mixed in around southern New Jersey and the east end of Long Island. When we take a look at our surface map, there's our high pressure system. So continue to shift towards the Gulf of Maine. And so as a result, we'll get a little bit more of a northeasterly wind. You see these troughs down here. Well, that is associated with this upper level low that has been spinning about in the Tennessee River Valley for a few days now. It's led to an onshore flow and a threat for an isolated shower or two the past few days. But overall, generally tranquil weather conditions while very heavy rainfall has been focused around West Virginia and Virginia. What will happen is that this upper level low will finally start to make its way towards our neck of the woods by the time we get to tomorrow afternoon. And that's going to lead to the development of showers and some of those showers will be capable of some very heavy downpours. So we're definitely going to have to keep an eye on that. Closer to home you can see high pressure is building south and so as a result clearing skies throughout the region we still have some low clouds here and there that will start to burn off as we move on through the morning hours. And these clouds will remain to the south for much of the day, but then start to push northward by this, by this evening. So let's dive into this forecast for today. High pressure and control look for clear sky to sky cloud cover. Temperatures will range from the lower to mid 60s on Long Island and upper 60s to lower 70s away from the coast. By the time we get to tonight, look for increasing cloud cover with showers developing down towards Cape May, but the rest of the region should be dry tomorrow morning. Look for lows tomorrow morning in the upper 40s to lower 50s. For tomorrow afternoon, showers will spread throughout the region, becoming heavy towards the evening. Look for temperatures to range from the upper 60s to lower 70s for highs. On Saturday, periods of rain, especially in the morning, tapering off towards evening. Look for a scattered cloud cover by the time we get to the late evening hours. Temperatures on Saturday will range from the mid to upper 50s for lows, Lower to mid 60s on the immediate coast, upper 60s to lower 70s everywhere else. Now on Sunday and Monday, high pressure will be in complete control. But this high pressure system is from the Canadian Maritime. So that's going to lead to an onshore wind and a marine air mass in place. So as a result, for Sunday and Memorial Day, look for temperatures to range from the mid to upper 40s for lows and mid to upper 60s for highs. Lower 70s as you get further in than let's say towards the Poconos away from that maritime air mass. On Tuesday and Wednesday, high pressure still tries to hold on, but these weak troughs are going to approach. That's going to lead to the threat for scattered broken cloud cover and isolated showers. You can also say the same thing for Thursday as well. It's pretty much a rinse and repeat once again. Temperatures through the period range from the mid 50s to lower 60s for lows and Mid to upper 60s on Long Island, upper 60s to lower 70s on the New Jersey coast, and mid 70s to lower 80s everywhere else. That is your forecast discussion for today. Of course, I'm your meteorologist, Stephen D. Martino, and as always, stay safe out there.